Good day, everyone. Welcome to Go Birding Taiwan channel. This is my Facebook page name, and I hope someday in the future you may think or you may talk to your friends saying, "Hey, let we go birding Taiwan." Okay, this is mine. My name is Patrick Lee. I study alien species, green iguana, 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 during master in NPUST. I work in as a birding guide for four years. In the past four years, I take many teams and members to successfully get all the Taiwan endemic birds. Most of people always ask, where is Taiwan? They will look this map, Taiwan located here. From this map, I guess further will more know about Taiwan. Taiwan located the middle of the East Asian Australian Flyway. The East Asia Australia Flyway is a home to over 50 million migration water birds from over 250 different populations, including 32 global theratine species and 19 theratine species. Travel after COVID-19, I think Taiwan is good choice. You can see this picture, Taiwan now very safe. And thanks many countries for their willingness to donate vaccine to Taiwan. Thank you, American. Arigato Nihon. Ashu Litova. Jaguyala Subatia. Di Jack Republic. Okay. This is my uh, short PowerPoint outline. Uh, I will talk bird in Taiwan first, then not only birds. Final, I will introduce many interesting things in Taiwan. Okay, let me take a look, birds in Taiwan. We have 30 endemic and 55 endemic sub in Taiwan. Um, this is the uh, endemic birds in Taiwan, the list in 2017 I did. And this is the endemic subspecies in Taiwan I did in 2017. Okay, first let we look uh, Taiwan blue magpie. They have some interesting behavior is those trick from this year young male will keep stay with their parents. Next year, will help their parents to build a nest, feed a new brown chick. We call it helper at a nest. Then Mikado pheasant. The discovery of the Mikado pheasant only through a pair of males central tail feeders. The research at that time, they know it's an unknown new bird. So the type specimen of this pheasant comprise two such tails feathers obtained in 1906 by the um, collector Walter Goldfield from the handdress of one of his porter in Taiwan. Uh, this is Swinho pheasant. Um, Sometimes we can very easily to see this in the roadside in Da Shan, Taiwan, Taichung. Next, Taiwan rose finch. You can see its color, whole body red is very amazing. And then Taiwan Yuhina, a passerine bird species. Um, multiple non-related females lay eggs together in the same nest. And then all group members cooperate to feed in their youngs. Very interesting. This behavior we call it joint nesting system. So far, no more than 20 species per have this behavior. But why they develop this behavior? Many scientists is study now. So why not come and see this so cool bird? Okay, then elegant scops all. 
Elkan scopes all, the distribution range is very, very limited. Only found a small island chain along the coast of East Asia. Strictly for isolation make the elegant scopes all become four subspecies. Um, distribute in UQ Island in Japan, Aki Island in Taiwan, and Batan in the Philippines. The study shows the four subspecies may be spread in the future based on the sound and other conditions. Oh, this is very, very rare bird in Taiwan and a good bird, a small white bird, which brings in northern eastern Russia and winters in southern East Asia. The species is highly certain by 20 by 2000 estimate, breeding population of this species was no more than 500, even only 300. It has been in the IUCN red list, currently in danger. This bird, light green, leg flag 88, is a female bird bounding during the breeding season at Russia. This bird has been observed from uh, 2019 December, I found it, and until 2020 April 10. So if you are lucky enough, you can enjoy watching this very rare bird in a not so far distance. I, I think only 50 meter. So what are you waiting for? Come. Oh, this is a Chinese crest term, a, a royal more rare bird. After it found in 1863, it has an appeared in no more than 100 years. And it was once considered extinct until the research in Taiwan Mazu in 1999 found one. And next year, 2000, found four adult birds and four chicks. It still can find in Mazu, Taiwan during their breeding season. Still possible to find them on the coast of Taiwan in migration season like April and May. Current data show the total number of this species may be still not no more than 100. This is my friend, he took this picture in 2020 April. And that time I also visit there, but my camera and uh, my photo quality is not so good. Um, the distance, although it's not so far, uh, maybe I remember that day is 150. I think it's quite close. So if you are lucky enough or your camera is good enough, you can take picture better than this. What are you waiting for? Come to see. Then you can see, did you see the uh, student hole pheasant? So quite close with the birder and photographer. And this is the, the view we can see. Did you find a Mikado pheasant? Yes, still not so far with the photographer and birder. So why, why, why are we waiting for? And next, I will talking about not only birds, many creatures in Taiwan is Taiwan endemic or endemic sub. You can find it when you in a birding trip in Taiwan. This is one view in Taiwan Taichung Da Xue Shan. Butterfly in Taiwan, more than 400 species and 50 is endemic. Most more than 4,000 species in Taiwan. Estimate 25% is endemic and endemic sub unknown. The dragonfly, we have more than 116 species and uh, 29 is endemic. Frog, although we only have 36, not very much, but we still have almost half is endemic. Snake, 
we also have many snacks and some of them is very beautiful. Okay, finally, many interesting things in Taiwan. When we get all endemic or almost get all endemic, I usually bring my customer to experience something interesting. For example, this is the one view in Lanyu Island. Snorkeling in Lanyu Island, you can see many colorful fish like that, or scuba diving in Kandin. Chances are high that you can swim with the sea turtle like this photo. And T, Taiwan. Most people first think about is para milk teas. Of course, it was invented in Taiwan. But until a few years ago, that I know that Taiwan products some of the best tea in the world, especially Taiwan's oolong and black tea, has developed an international reputation. So if time enough, sometime we will stay at the tea farm and test the tea. Oh, then shaved ice. Taiwan is quite hot, but virtually we have shaved ice. Taiwan shaved ice is an invitation to get creative as you like. First, you need shaved ice into a pile or mountain, depending on you. If you want a lot, you can put it like a mountain. Yep, no serious, no kidding. And uh, you, and it's tough. You can blend with your favorite, such as fresh fruit like mangoes strawberry or pineapple. And finally, you can put the milk or chocolate. Then enjoy the pole dance on the roadside. Are you kidding me? Yes, no. You can see this is pole dance on the roadside. When we finish, almost finished the Berlin trip, we found it very interesting things. My customer thinks, wow, it's a very unique experience for them. And this is Taiwanese opera. Also, you can enjoy that on the roadside. Okay, let's take a look about my customer review. Uh, she recommend me because I help them find a spoonbill stem piper. Okay, so if you're interested to go birding in Taiwan, you can contact me through my Facebook, Go Birding in Taiwan, or my mail, like that. Okay, finally, thank you for your time. See you, Go Birding in Taiwan, when you go birding in Taiwan.